His childhood home must have been here somewhere. Klaus Thiel was nine when he had to flee his hometown Kostun, which was destroyed by Soviet bombers in the Second World War. It was a brutal rupture. From one day to the next, we were nothing. Nowadays, the town is part of Poland. The journalist spends a lot of time here these days. He is showing two Polish treasure hunters where part of his family legacy, his history might be buried. That was the Commandant's headquarters. Here's my house, number 22. But little remains of it. They're trying to unearth the cellar. Thiel wants to get in there. I have a lot of beautiful books down here. And my relatives have some real treasures down there. Silver cutlery for 24 people. And porcelain. And my mother had something that was very valuable back then. At least 20 jars full of potted meat. The family was forced to leave almost everything behind. The same was true of some 12 million Germans who fled or were expelled as Nazi Germany crumbled. Thiel dreams of finding a memento of the past, but it's not looking good. The cellar is too deeply buried. We need completely different machinery to dig here. It's a tragedy. What else can I say? The men try their luck next door. Perhaps they can get into the cellar of Thiel's childhood home from there. While Thiel waits above ground, the professionals creep into the cellar of the former pharmacy. German soldiers were entrenched here during the battle for the town. Entry is prohibited. The treasure hunters from the association called Perkun could be risking their lives. When the bomb hit the house, the whole top story collapsed. This could give way at any moment. It's a dangerous endeavor, but Thiel is pleased with the results. The treasure hunters bring him objects that belong to the house's inhabitants, awakening memories of his childhood more than 70 years ago. Hutschenreuter, very expensive porcelain. And an inkwell, inside a small shell brought home from the Baltic. For me, each of these objects awakens emotions, even if they didn't belong to my family. Maybe they belong to people I knew. The treasure seekers are unable to reach the cellar of his childhood home. Thiel isn't sure whether he'll continue the hunt. But he says retrieving parts of his childhood in this way is a healing process.